Hello, happy Tuesday, happy new week to you. I come to share a weekly word, and this week's word is be you. Have you ever noticed that even if you look like someone, say you're an identical twin, you are uniquely identified by your fingerprints, by your dental records, by your own DNA. It's not like you can be fooled to be someone else. That lets you know that God created us all as individuals for a reason. We all have differences for a reason. We all have something to offer to this world. You don't have to compete with anybody. In fact, you should celebrate another's accomplishments, another's prowess in whatever they're good at or whatever they're bad at. I don't care how good you are at something. It's probably going to be somebody better than you. It's probably going to be somebody worse than you in that. But it's going to be something that is just yours, that you stand out at, outstanding, and that you are great at. You know, and that you that's what you should celebrate. The only person you should constantly compete with is just yourself to improve yourself, to get better, to work harder, to get smarter. You know, but like I said, it takes all the differences of the world, all the diversity of the world for us to come together and have something to give to one another and to like if, if you're good at one thing and your husband's good at something else it comes together and makes a whole if your brothers got this gift and you got that gift it comes together and y'all are able to work things out and do things that benefit and enhances each other that's life and that's what we're supposed to do as individuals and have our own mark and have our own contribution to the world and it's important that you remember that, that you need to be yourself at all times. Have your own mind. It's okay if uh, five apples are, you know, like you said, one of these things does not belong. But sometimes it's okay to not belong. It's, not, it's okay to not think like everyone else. It's this scene by George S. Patton. If everyone is thinking alike all the time, then someone is not thinking. Because you're going to have different thoughts. You're going to have different things. You're going to have different skills. You're going to have different processes. And I encourage you just to keep on being you. Be your own individual self. Shine where you shine. And remember that. Uh, celebrate others at where they shine. Remember that you're loved. God loves you the most. And I love you. Remember to always be kind to yourself and others. Be joyful and be blessed and be your individual self because you were made to walk and shine and walk in your stuff and own it love you much bye